Hi, okay, job tonight is to start painting the stones and the flags and edge stones around the well which has been left until now. Um, <coughs> I'm going to do these the same as I've done the rest of them, so this is a bit of an insight in how to, I did the rest of the stones. Uh, not particularly good at tutorials, but uh, hopefully you'll be able to understand what I'm saying. Okay, the stones have been laid. If you saw my last couple of posts on the on the site, you'll see how I've done that. Um, they've been primed with a grey primer. <coughs> this is just purely to make them take the paint a bit better. Uh, as you see later on, um, I'll be uh, painting these quite dark in the end, so it doesn't quite look as bright as they look. Um, okay, uh, there's the stones. That's the old palette I'm using. As you see, actually this is pretty clean compared to normal. Five, only five colours used. White, black, raw umber, burnt sienna and yellow ochre. And what I do basically, I just take another hole, mix the paint in like so, until I get a sort of colour I'm looking for. This case is quite a dark, too dark, so I'll put some white in there, and it'll come up. And then, if you notice, I'm not mixing it too well, I don't want the paint to be too even. And all I'm doing is picking out a couple of stones at a time, like so, over a certain area. What I might do is occasionally I might put three or four stones in, like so, just to put a bit of evenness in there, like they are coming a batch. Or I might make a whole area of them. As you see, I'm just touching the top of the stones. I'm using a number three flat brush, which actually is exceedingly good for this because it's the right size. Okay, change the colour a bit. Take off most of the paint. And again, the old stone here and there. Like this. A couple of them the same there. As you see, even of other, even the same colours on the brush, because I've not overfilled it too much, and the paint isn't hasn't been mixed too well, you do tend to get a different colour from stone to stone, which all goes to help. To break up the monotony, the uniformity of the uh, of the model. I don't like uniformity. Just that because he used to be in the army, which was uniform. And this is what I'll do now for the next couple of hours. Yes, it does take a long time, but when you look at the previous work, I think you can see. It's worth it.